to the extent of that, we are still kind of checking off those questions mark, question marks at this point. But as of the 2 p.m. update, we are dealing with an area of disorganized thunderstorm activity over Central America. Over the next 48 hours, not looking very likely for any development, but it's really once we get towards early to the middle of next week, this is where we're going to have to watch our disturbance. This disturbance, try to get its act together. I'm taking you through the weekend. Let's stop this on Saturday night. This is our European model, so we're looking far ahead into the future. This is showing some area of organization trying to get its act together, likely trying to even turn into a depression as early as Sunday, but that potential will grow as this energy does push away from the Caribbean and into the southeast Gulf of Mexico. The European model has really been betting that this is going to try to turn into something tropical, something organized in the eastern Gulf of Mexico by Tuesday going into Wednesday, fleeing in all that moisture our direction. The GFS, another global model that we check, keep an eye on very closely, not quite buying that timing, the basically the strengthening or the placement of this development, this potential development. It does pick up the tropical moisture, that's for sure. But once we get closer to early to middle next week, it drifts it more so over Cuba, not really ever getting its act together, but still trying to bring rain our way. So we do have still a lot of question marks that we're going to be watching for you over the weekend. But bottom line, 60% chance in the next five to seven days. So early to middle of next week, we could have some tropical development. A depression could be as early as late weekend, but that's when we'll have to watch out for any advisories or as well as that cone. That's when we would see that forecast come out. So keep an eye on the forecast over the weekend. It's going to change especially as we get into early next week impacts. I'm talking rain, maybe even some of those winds will get very, very dicey as far as watching that timing by the early parts of next week. So Monday night, Tuesday and into Wednesday. So we'll keep you updated, especially as that placement gets going into next week. That's also when we could see again that increase of rain chances. We'll take a look.